got to trust the process. And I think that's part of it. Sometimes we don't know the process. I would say those three things. I, I call it the training trifecta, task completion, temperament, foundation. But most people train at horses, it's instant task completion, and they ignore the foundation and the temperament, and that's when the blow-ups are. You have to put the work in to be successful, and it doesn't matter who your dad or your grandpa or who, who anyone is, you get in the pit with the horse. One of the great privileges and responsibilities of any veterinarian is to be able to terminate incurable pain and suffering. There aren't going to be miracles, but sometimes there's a bad outcome. But the people who are successful with horses, trainers, owners, veterinarians, are not horse whisperers, they're horse listeners. Listen is, is a big part of the equation. I just remember one thing I heard one of the nurses say, and that was, she said, well, let's not worry about that. Let's just see if she's ever gonna walk again. I was not ready for that. I wasn't ready for that to be the last ride of my life. And I started that, that riding journey over again. And um, I was nervous, I was scared to get back on a horse. I didn't know if I would be able to sit the same, if I would be able to ride the same, if I'd be fearful. And there were absolutely times when uh, we would come to a show like this to watch our friends and we'd be excited for them, but also in my heart, I was a little bit bitter and a little bit discouraged thinking this is never gonna happen for me. Whatever your dream is, we all need to be willing to adjust our attitude because we can be angry, and I was. I was angry sometimes when I wasn't able to pursue this dream when I thought it was right. Or we can choose joy and gratitude and be thankful for the journey that we're on. If I'm doing it right, if I'm really being a better horsewoman and I'm listening to my horse and I'm being the best partner to him or her that I can be, that makes me a better person.